welcome to Let's Play Discuss Super Punch Out. This is Ron Moore with the Wee Gun and the Star Soldier. Oh yeah, how's everybody doing out there? All right, now we're fighting Macaulay Culkin. Ooh, a narcissist prince. <laughs> I get it. Yeah. No, no. Okay, we're fighting Jeff. I don't know. He doesn't have that good of hair. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Fight. Yeah. I don't get it. Why would you not want your face <laughs> to be like touched if you're gonna box? That's like. I know, much. right? Ta yeah, a punch out <laughs> version of Tyler Breeze here. Oh. I will have to admit, he is stunning. Yeah, I always like, you know, fighting this guy because he does protect his face pretty well. Yeah. Until you do one particular move. Crotch punch? No, wait, wait. Are you fighting Jack Vitry's son? He has the V on his sweater. <laughs> no, it stands for oh, uh, Val Valley High. What an arrogant fighter. Look at that. When he moves, he just stands there waiting for you to catch up to him. Oh, nonchalant and cocky. Well, he is the Narcissus Prince. His record is 12 and 3. It's not that <laughs> impressive. I was in the special circuit when Super Macho Man had a fair record. He's a special well, he's case, first guy play, at least. I think it's supposed to be similar because you beat 12 hour bosses or that he's in the same rank as you are. That maybe he had 12 victories and 3 losses. What's so special about him? Well, he's good at blocking, at least. <laughs> Except now when he gets in tank mode. Yeah. I'm gonna hit you. <laughs> I was in rage mode. <laughs> I love it when you knock him down. Yeah. Oh! Oh! <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I was in those tennis shorts. Yeah, they need a butt shot there. It's yeah. all with that, Nintendo. You can't put ring girls in your punch out games, but you'll show that. Yeah. It's all about male masculinity. <laughs> oh. And knocking them out. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. Well, he's going to be home alone tonight. <laughs> As we guy wins. Definitely not a good son. I'm yeah. trying to make a bad movie he started in, but I, I just remember home alone and... I think, I think that's it. Uh, yeah. Black career. No, he did. You know, he did some other roles like uh, the Good Son, uh, Richie Rich. Uh Oh yeah. Uh Ah, uh, Boy Carlo. Jeez. Or seventy-eight no, years old. Pi May from Kill Bill, sixty-two and thirteen. <laughs> his age is almost as high as his weight. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I think they got those two mixed up. Uh, he's pretty good, though. He cheats, though. <laughs> well, he's 78 years old. He's got to have a cane. <laughs> <laughs> Who would ever allow this guy in? The World Boxing... Video, World Video Boxing Association? <laughs> yeah. They let Mike Tyson in. Yeah. And he cheats like uh, nobody else. Yeah. This is Dragon okay, Chan. This is Dragon Chan's teacher. What about Jackie Chan? No. No? Ah, oh, come on. So I thought, oh, dang it. Well, yeah, Miss Miyagi is pretty tricky. Whoa. Do you like become flat? Whoa, so it's teacher versus the student. It's Karate Kid versus Mr. Miyagi. Yeah, this is the next sequel where instead of karate, it's boxing, but they still call it the Karate Kid. Yeah. Or karate <laughs> boxing. I know that's a thing. Oh, wait, I think that's oh, Daniel Smith's son. Daniel son. Yeah. Not, not down. Fight. Daniel son just knocked down Mr. Miyagi. What a like two man fool. To Wong Fu, thanks for everything, Julie Newmore. What? No. <laughs> Oh, and he's on a target kill if he's not careful. <laughs> You're gonna murder an old creepy, man. Look at this creepy thumbnail up there. It is a bit creepy. Kind of interesting when he transitions, the timer stops. Oh yeah. It's like when he's in the air, the time doesn't count. 
I guess because there's no way to hit him, and so it, it'd never be unfair in time attack mode. I guess so. But in real time, that it, it still counts. <laughs> well, it's just like wrestling. It's not real. Okay, he's jumping up in the air. Stop the timer. <laughs> yeah. Well, the ref is saying, no, don't do that. Don't jump up in the air. You're disqualified. Yeah. Give me that cane. <laughs> yeah. All right. Oh, okay. George Foreman now. Rick Bruiser. We don't know where he's from. We don't know how old he is. But we his brother is the 41 and 1 record. Yeah, his brother is the one behind the one and 41 and 1. Yeah, I know his age. It when was a client, huge undertaking. Yeah, when this client, Nick Bruiser, Rick beat Bruiser. Rick Bruiser at WrestleMania <laughs> or Boxing Mania. Uh, Rip Bruce is pretty cool. J-Man said he's never got past him. He is a pretty tough guy. Like, here's where the game, you know, gets you in the balls in difficulty. Yeah. Yeah, it's a shame the Bruiser brothers look so much alike, though. You know, they're basically twins. Yeah. Oh! And knock oh, out. ouch. Yeah, the only difference is Rick will smile at you, and Nick will just give you a, a big old frown. Yeah. Oh my god, his freaking legs and feet are square. Look at that, look at this. His feet are square. <laughs> okay, well there they look kind of round, but when yeah. he's like standing in front of you, his like, leg, look at this, like, it's like cereal boxes he's wearing. You want to say that to his face. There's no point. It's not a taunt or anything, it's a real fact. Look at that. He's wearing square shoes or his legs are super square. Yeah. It's so weird. Well, that's because he likes a square dance. Well, I guess when you get super built and buff, everything a part of you just becomes really like firm and like square. Yeah, just like Strong Mad. Huh. Right. Oh, he's sucking his thumb in the corner. Oh, nom, nom. I hate when he flashes like that. Yeah. Oh, he's flashing Mac. Oh. God, that's it. Ooh. Finesse. Got it. Pizza cake. Yeah. No, because I got knocked down once, so... Pizza cake? <laughs> Yum. Yeah. Yeah, they should make a pizza cake, but I think they had before. Yeah. <laughs> Ham and Dharma X. Now we fight the champ. Oh, God. He has little to say. A man of few words. 42 and 0. Weighs the same as his brother. Twin, twins and brothers, and or brothers in every regard. Yeah. <laughs> you know, Nintendo loves to do that, though. It, no, it's an all-new boxer, honest. Mass Muscle is not like Super Macho Man. <laughs> yeah. Gabby J is not like Bob Charlie. This guy is the Iceman of Super Punch Out. It's like D. Belenko is the Iceman of wrestling. Pretty much no emotion. Yeah, thankfully he's a lot easier than Tyson, though. He yeah. doesn't knock you out with one punch right away. Even though he does yeah. have one of punch power. Yeah. Get to the punchline. <laughs> yeah, he's trying to rip off su uh, stuff, Super Sandman. He's trying to rip off Mr. Sandman there. Oh, Foreman is down. Foreman is down. <laughs> Red Foreman. It is almost like Red Foreman. He does have a nicer tan than his brother. Oh, he's almost... I that. He's pretty much... Yeah. Spent too much time the same in the feet. sun. He had the same feet? He had the same box feet, oh. except he's got green shoes. <laughs> oh, dang, he bruised my left... My left hand. 
Oh, he bruised my neck. Well, here's the bruiser. So, wait, you got Rick Bruiser, Nick Bruiser. Where's Dick the Bruiser? Nick, Rick, and Dick. Yeah. Maybe they're related to Alan Dick. Yeah. Wake up, you idiot. Hey, Pat Pat, get up, Nick. Oh! Come on, eat it? him. <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, you got served. Yeah. Oh. There goes the mouthpiece. Oh, look at him. He's back in the corner. Thing Yeah, I would not want to do a neck ring like that. <laughs> yeah, those evil green eyes. Oh, that's it. Oh, that was easy. Yeah. Oh, sweet. Easy peasy. Right on. Hey, look, you see his face. Oh, wait, we already see his face, though. But now he, <laughs> he turns around after beating someone. Well, yeah, I did that after he beat Bald Wolf, Mr. Sandman, and Super Macho Man. Yeah, sadly, that's it, though. Only, you know, 16 bosses, and then the game was over. Well, how many was there in regular Punch-Out? I think 15. But, yeah, in the original arcade Punch-Out, there's only 6. Uh. Yeah, in the arcade original Super Punch-Out, there's only 5. Uh, like, uh, <laughs> I just nerdy that I knew on, that. Come on, I love Patty J. He tries so hard. Oh, right, the Canadian. <laughs> yeah. I'm wearing overalls right now. Yeah, but he sucks. <laughs> he suffered the Gabby J at least. Yeah. Kiwi Gooding Jr. Yeah. <laughs> now he's definitely easier than yeah. Bear yeah. hugger. Bald bull, who, bald bull who got demoted from Punch Out is in, in minor circuit now. Yeah. Poor guy. Yeah. Huh. Bob Marley. I'm Mister. I'm Jamaican ish man. <laughs> yeah, see, he goes and more. I wonder if they just make offended by that. There's we got. Oh, Los Weirdo. Oh, sweet. Los I love Los Weirdos. Adios. Adios. <laughs> yeah, he even taunts you a little. Bruce is he'll get amigo. And Super Robot Soldier from YouTube. Yep. Good night. Yeah, it's weird how he became the end boss of the new Wii Punch Out. Oh, you know that. I like that though. Mr. Sandman's cool. There's J Man. Oh my gosh. Aaron Ryan. Yeah. Oh yeah. Aaron Union. Union. Whoa. Whoa, I didn't Man, that guy is. Oh, wait, that's me. No. <laughs> get that. Look at that hair. Damn. Should have hair like that. Oh, wait, I'm pretty ish. What a pretty man. Oh, oh Jesus Lord Almighty. It's the closest thing to girl on the game. Basically, bear oh, hugger. She. Put clown makeup on. <laughs> that's yeah. scary as hell. I'm 28 years old. <laughs> uh, that seems about right. I don't know why his hair is gray already. But that's what I mean, his hair, like, what the heck? Yeah, it's, it's, stressful hey, life. it's Mario! Charles Mario. Maybe it's silver. Oh. Ken Lobb. And, and Jeff. Yeah. sounds familiar. Yeah. Silent Lobb. Wait. Mr. Miyagi. What a, what a weird one. Yeah. Rick Flair. 
<laughs> it's the right back. <laughs> and, and Nick. And you. Oh, me. Hey, it's so sheen. Okay, so 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 for the feet. Seems about right. Hey, oh, the almighty oh. champ, or ultimate champ. Yep. This is Scarlet Air's off world champ. In 20 and 1, <laughs> Super Monster Man is the one behind the one in 20 and 1. And so that is it for Super Punch Out for the SNES. And now for the Let's Discuss. Yay. This game is not as memorable as the original, but it was still pretty fun for its time. I remember when they announced it, and I was like, whoa, a punch up for Super Nintendo? I mean, back then you got real excited when your favorite NES game was going to have a sequel on the Super Nintendo, like with Mega Man. I mean, I was like, whoa, Mega Man on Super Nintendo? And then Zelda on Super Nintendo? No way. Metroid? And then Super Punch Out was one of those. And so, yeah, I enjoyed it back then, but not as good as the original Punch Out. Nothing's going to beat the original. Um, and But Super Punch Out was still fun. Much easier than the original. Even though a lot of boxers cheat, I understand why they did that to to make it more, I guess, more fun. And instead of the same old regular punches that you saw in Punch Out, they wanted to make it somewhat different. So I guess this was like um, ECW boxing in a way, where they really let the rules slide. And you know, you got boxers who kick, spit, and use a cane and elbow you and all that stuff. And so it's it's pretty fun because there's a lot of different elements to it. And the music, catchy, but not as memorable as in regular Punch-Out. But Super Punch-Out was not a, a bad game to play. It was pretty fun. It was fun to go back and play it again here. So, with that said, I'm about to give Super Punch-Out maybe, I'm not sure, either a 7.5 or 8 out of 10. We got? Uh, let's see. Super Punch-Out. I didn't, uh, never played it, still haven't played it. There was something about it that just didn't look as good as the, of course, original Punch-Out. Uh, maybe because it borrowed a little bit of elements from the arcade, like with the meter at the bottom. But, I mean, that's just like a, another gameplay mechanic, of course, borrowed. But, I don't know, there's something off about Super Punch-Out. Still a good game, obviously. Still a good follow-up. You know, still in the same vein as Punch-Out is with its style. You know, still has, you know, quirky, fun... Uh, boxers some of which some of which are memorable i guess maybe memorable now that some of them are of course revived in the wii punch out but still something about super punch out that seemed a little bit lackluster but nonetheless still a good game still a good uh classic uh super nintendo title and it's nice to see that punch out did get its treatment on the super nintendo and i would probably give super punch out eh, probably a six out of ten all right, Star Soldier. Now, I'm gonna have to disagree with you guys on this one here because I really thought Super Punch Out was a much greater sequel than Mike Tyson's Punch Out. Okay, now you have the charm of having Mike Tyson in the original game. That's all cool, but here you got 16 boxers to worry about in this game. You have an all new save feature, a whole new time attack mode, which is definitely a welcome bonus. Yeah, I kind of miss having Doc Lewis by your side, and, you know, they took out the round system. That was kind of lame, but I love the new power meter at the bottom that was in the arcade one, and they included it here. I love that system well, you know, at least a lot better than what was the star counter system in the NES version of Punch-Out, because, you know, you sort of have to time your shots to get those stars and once you get hit you lose them here you just lose a little bit of your power meter if you get hit but you know it's successful hits you get your super meter and do boom you can use your either one really strong punch or new rapid punches which can really set combos to get that knockout a whole lot quicker there's a whole lot of new depth to the gameplay especially with how the boxers can cheat, but you can also counter them, you know, in just the right way to make sure you can get that fastest time possible. 
And this is great for speedrunners that just want to get that perfect time. Yes, it's possible to knock out guys like Pissinana in just six measly seconds. You know, <laughs> well, other guys like you know, Nick Bruiser, it's definitely going to be a lot more difficult. I love the challenge. I love the characters. I love the animation. I love the 16-bit gloss to it, especially compared to the little tiny character, little Matt that you had before. Having the more translucent character in Super Punch-Out makes it look a whole lot better. So, you know, I don't have to be embarrassed now at looking at the older games. And, oh, man, it doesn't look as good as I remember. But here, it still holds up. And that's why I get Super Punch Out here for the Super Nintendo, a 94 out of 100. Highly recommended. The Tom and Type mode was a very good addition to it. I've seen speed runs of it, and I mean, Gabby J can be beaten in six seconds. Bear Hugger, I think, 12 seconds or something like that. I gotta go back and look. I watched, recently I watched the Speed Demos archive, um, and I've seen all of them, I think, uh, the Bruiser Brothers probably got beaten in like 15 seconds or something like that. and Yeah, so uh, it's pretty cool to watch. And uh, so the time attack mode was definitely fun to see if you can beat your old records, see if you can, your friends can beat your record and whatever. And so, yeah, that was pretty cool. And, yeah, so the save features, all that stuff, that is pretty cool. But to me, it's just, I mean, I just thought regular Punch-Out was better, but regardless, Super Punch-Out, was very good, very fun for its time. The new, cool new features were awesome. I just wish they would have put Soda Pop Penske back in there, but oh well. At least you had the original three bosses from Punch Out, Bald Bull, Mr. Sandman, and Super Macho Man. And yeah, so definitely not a bad game. And it was yeah, cool. If you want to see those really characters, playing. yeah, if you want to see the original characters updated, I highly recommend Punch Out for the Wii. And Nintendo, you know, get off your butt and re-release these games or make a new Punch-Out for the Wii U. Give me a reason why that's... And, yeah, this is my first time playing this game in 20-something years. I mean, I really never... hadn't sat down and played it since probably 95, 96. And so, yeah, it was good to do this game. All right, guys, that is it. We are out of here on Ron Moore. The Wii guy. And Star Soldier, Arizona, World Heavyweight Champion, baby. Oh, yeah. God bless. Take care. Time to punch out. Do I get paid for this?